Hi, in this presentation I want to show you how you can use Colorpro to color a website. We will use Google for this. Open the Google's home page. We have it here on the left and on the right we have um, the Google's color palette. This palette here. You can uh, save it to palettes. So if you press this button it will go into the palette section here and you double click it and then you will see it in the edit palette section here uh, coming back here uh, what I want to do is actually change the color of this um, web page the controls to do this are these here web page color control first of all I uh, uncheck this checkbox because it allows me to click on links and stay on the same page as you can see okay um, then I want to work with this element here okay and change its uh, text color, its background color its border top, left, bottom, right colors first of all let's change the text color um, we use the default color picker for this basically what we have to do here is um, let's have a little bit more space like this first of all we should get uh, the color we want to work with so I'll double click on red and then click on this one let's choose a more vivid color here okay I have the text color checked then I can click here and the text turns to red then if I want to change the background color to let's say green or cyan I double click here, here and then here um, I can also change these colors first I have to check their uh, checkboxes and then select them individually first we'll use red for this then we'll use um, blue for this green for this and yellow for this then double click here and everything has turned the way I set them in here now let's change the entire background color for this we will work with this background color we select it as green double click on green green and we start clicking around okay 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 yep and then here okay so everything is basically green actually this is an image and that's why it cannot be colored uh, furthermore I can uh, work with the single elements using the element tab what I did so far was work with the entire web page but what I can do now and I'm going to show you is select single elements lock them and work only with those with that element for example when you hover over an element you see its HTML code right here uh, in order to lock an element I have to press this button pick element with mouse then click on the element I'll click this one then this one becomes disabled this one enabled and I have the HTML code right here this allows me to set the colors only for this text box right here so I want to change its text color first I will use the sliders here they are more they are better for this job so you see I can vary the sliders and the text color varies along the let's put everything to black as you can see this one is black um, let's say I want to keep it black and I want to vary the background color so what I'm going to do now is check the background color um, this one must be unlocked and play with it and see a color that I like okay this is an interesting color then I uncheck it and I have it set let's work with the um, bigger element now I unlock this element and want to work with the bigger one 
let's say this one here and play with its background color let's see what we can this way nice and let's put it to white okay let's use this one and play with the colors oh. cool I'm going to also show you how to vary these colors here so let's vary the border top color oh first we have to select an element which supports that so uh, I'm going to pick this one again and play with its other top color let's play with all of them maybe we can see something see I can see something yep and if I want I can play with all of them like this I have to answer Uh, and pick one. 